YouTubers, coming back to you with another Windows 8 tutorial. And the last tutorial that I mentioned before you guys was about how to go ahead and disable the Metro UI ribbon. I believe I used a registry hack and we manually went inside the registry editor and we disabled it, then logged off and we saw the effect. So that may or may not have been a hassle to most of you guys. So what I'm going to go ahead and do is come back with a round two in an updated version with a program on how to simply disable or enable it. With a program right here, which you can see, is called Ribbon Disabler 2, version 2. It's by Happy Bulldozer. And what it does is when you go ahead and right click on it, go ahead and run as administrator, what you'll see is that by disabling the Ribbon Explorer, you can go ahead and make it similar to Windows 7 Explorer. So all you have to do is just disable it by pressing here and then to see the effects, you can go ahead and log off now. So I'll go ahead and log off right now. All right, so we are back. We are back logged on. So let's go ahead and see the effect of the Metro UI ribbon being disabled. And as you can see, it has been disabled with a click of a button. All you have to do is log off and log back on, and you should be good with the Metro UI ribbon completely disabled. So that's it. If you guys have any questions or suggestions, go ahead and leave them in the comments box below. And if you do like this video for the fact that it's a lot easier, just go ahead and thumbs up or like it. And remember, this is the 64 bit and this is the 32 bit. I don't think there is much difference if you have a 64 bit to use either or but just to play it safe just go ahead and use the one that is part of your architecture windows 8 all right so i hope you guys like this and goodbye